They were back in Yankee Stadium, and they were. There was hope. We 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 just brought out to win two games in a row, and the Yankee fans. <sighs> and then guess what happened? Whoop! The rug, right out from under you. And you know what's happening to younger Yankee fans? I'm gonna tell you what's happening because it's been so long since they won, and they lose in such spectacular fashion now. You know what's happening is they're getting the mentality of losers. Do you know what somebody we were we were laughing at some salty Yankee fans in the hotel lobby. And because last week I I thought I was better, and this is the mistakes I'm not gonna make anymore. Flew into LA for a day. Uh turns out wasn't. When there were some salty Yankee fans, this is when I saw Jacob. There were some salty Yankee fans. In the hotel lobby. One of the young guys was like, you yeah, the Yankees are like the Niners. They can't win the big one. Now, someone from my generation, the, the Niners and the Yankees, that's all they did was win. But they see you as losers, Yankee fans. That you can't win the big one. You know how happy that makes the majority of the country? It was like, oh, I honestly could have jerked off in the lobby. That is amazing. I had in my wildest dreams. That's not and then so game five, they're getting all this hope. Yeah. Hope. Yeah. Rug. Zeke. You know the best part of this is not just the somebody celebrating in Yankee Stadium says the Yankees, but cutting to the shots of the Yankee fans. Gah, in the stands. Gah. So much fun. That's how petty I am, everybody. That is how petty. I'm not claiming not to be petty. Uh, the the arrogance of the Yankee fan is like, you know, it's like it's it, it's like cowboy fans who enter every football season like they won last year. What the fuck? It's the it's so amazing. But I will say. And I and, and listen, I, I, the Red Sox fans were guilty of this too. But to light a city on fire in celebration of a team win is the dumbest fucking thing. It, it, and by the way, the the people who loot, I mean, it's dumb and smart, I guess, because they're like, nobody's gonna arrest us. We're just gonna go to the store. Everybody's lighting shit on fire. But it's the dumbest. That's how you're celebrating. And I heard somebody say, you know, the police just have a bad to have a better plan for this. No, you fuck. Just don't light buses on fire when your team wins. That's the plan. What don't don't break into the Nike factory because your team wins. You stupid fuck. It's not the cops. They should be out, you know, because there's a parade of some kind. Impromptu parade. No. You lit buses on fire and spray painted shit. You stupid. That's the dumbest. And if I looked up the list of like cities, you know, who rioted. I was so embarrassed to see Boston was on there three times. You fucking. It's the dumbest. Can we stop, please? Can we stop? Hey, if you like this podcast you just watched, you're going to love the one I'm popping up in your face right now. Check it out.